We are not alone. Look, kid, huh? what are you doing here? Peter, I had to come back for the giant radish. Last time, I failed you, my friend. So this time, ta-da! I brought help. You brought all the other squirrels here? They're all acrobats. Woo! Not quite as good as me, mind you. <gasps> what? We should get out of here. No, kid, we have to go. Mr McGregor will be here soon. Please. This is really dangerous. <laughs> if Mr McGregor catches you... OK, OK, we're right behind you. Just one more run. <laughs> <laughs> Squirrels! OK, guys, time for me to get that giant radish. <laughs> <laughs> Tidy's off, and we'll help you. Oh, whoop! Early off! Woo! Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! Ho I did it! <laughs> you may all clap now! Uh. Hello! Where did everybody go? Hey! Hey! <laughs> I knew you could do it! <laughs> of course! <laughs> but by the way, did you see where my squirrel tribe went? No, no, Kim. We haven't seen them. I don't understand. I didn't see them leave. And I've got good eyes. I don't miss a thing. Gotcha! <laughs> <laughs> well, you won't be bothering me again, ever. Oh, no! Mr McGregor's got Nutkin. <sighs> this is all my fault. It was my idea to bring Nutkin along in the first place. I've got to get him out. Uh, you can't keep us in here. We're wild animals. We need the great outdoors. And Felix gets very sweaty in confined spaces. <laughs> Peter, help us. It's too cramped in here. And uh, somebody doesn't smell too good. 